Hey, 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 everyone, Nicola Light here, remembering back into the light, um, allowing us to ignite our inner wisdom of how to heal ourselves, which is the ascension journey, the releasing of density from the physical body enables us to move deeper into ourselves, to see where there is the connection to our mind control of who we perceive ourselves to be and moving into the greater knowing of ourselves. So within this physical body um, here, in this now moment, I want to sort of tap into that inner wisdom. And I've just done a, a little bit of unpacking and some codes that came forward, which I'm putting out on my Patreon and my members' um, exclusive member um, video content. But I'm just going to sort of go into that um, overlay of that information that has come forward about how to release pain from the physical body, no matter what joint it is within, to enable you to move forward rather than claiming the pain within the body, which is basically um, the collection of emotions that is held within the form of the body itself. So if you want to check out that information, well, there was another lot of data that sort of came up as well, which is deepening into the healing journey. So check that out on Patreon and on my YouTube. So I'm just going to rub this off the board and then go deeper using some light codes to ignite the wisdom within myself to deepen in so that I'm offering this information for you so that you can deepen into your own healing journey itself. It's all about the code. It's all about code. Everything that is held within the physical body of form, which is the physicality of form, we are holding everything within a box, within a box, within a box, within a box. And within each box within the system, or we could perceive it to be a cellular system, it is um, a construct of this reality. And there is an overlay of information, data that we perceive from our mind that we are the body mind and not necessarily the esoteric self, which is the greater aspect of ourself and how we sit within the cosmos of understanding enables the mind to perceive itself to be when we are heightening and um, deepening into the remembrance of ourselves by igniting the codex within. Ah, ki ona dardi si makiaton to kola baskian to kuhora, van kare ba kiuto ni mispe kianto, mo kare ba kianto da si makiatam. Many restrictions within the mind stops the physical body from releasing the data within the deep cellular structure with a combination of the mindset that is held within the format of mind and the control of the system from an outward collective perspective, as well as an inner journey of the ignition of the wisdom of light within and the expression of light codex from many that are igniting light codes within their own physicality for the healing journey to take place so that the density release can then move out of physicality to enable the dis-ease within the physical body, the creation of pain response from a five sensory perception of reality to enable you to deepen into yourself. Oh, that sounds very complicated. So we're going to unpack it all so when this information comes in, it is expressed through a pure channel state through said Nicola, and then mind of Nicola then can upgrade itself by going like, what did you say? The information that came forward, as I just spoke about, um, which is the um, going into a little bit more simplistic sort of format can be accessed for you if you want to do that then have a little look at the link below. But otherwise, we're just going to sort of deepen into it in this particular video for you. Okay. So use the codes, thank you, to enable you to spark the rem rem remembrance within. Yeah. Thank you. We want to talk about the breath format within the release of pain. Now, when we look at the physical body itself, we go, oh my God, oh, God. oh that pain, oh my God. Mm. And you you get that sort of 
systematic, like, oh, I can feel like a cramp in the leg or a pain. And within the physical body, there is a movement that stops. There's a stopping of the physical body because you seize up, you seize up within the uh, physical body itself because it's painful. It's freaking painful. Yeah. Okay. So we hold pain and we freeze. We freeze the pain. Oh, freeze. <laughs> Couldn't put an S in it if you want. Freeze the pain. Da. So there is no body movement at all because it's painful to move the physical body. But when we look at the pain within the physical body and we see it as being energetic, then we don't need to freeze the physical body. What we do is we observe the pain with your peepers. And the perception of the third eye complex. So we go inward and we see through three eyes, the third eye, pain. We look at it and we go like, so it almost go like cross-eyed within. But this pain is held here. There's your third eye and you're looking at it here. We translate it into the physical body but everything is held here and everything in our reality outside of ourselves is held in what we call templates. If you perceive the pain to be in the body because we sense it into the body, then you will identify with it and then you would then create pain with a freezing of the body, okay? If you see it as here, third eye projection, I, 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 then you will see it outside of yourself. But you feel it in the body. So pain is in the body, but you see it here. You see it, you don't feel it, you see the pain within the body. We breathe into the body and adjust it by light, by upgrading the system, by the releasing of it in the deep cellular structure of the body. And the body will start to push the energy out of the joint within the body that allows this releasing of distorted data out of the system, out through the feet, flushing it out through the hands and out through the breath. Now, this, we're talking about joints here, but it could be muscular, it could be any of it, it could be, the, it's healing through breath. But is also the perception from the mind, because the mind holds and freezes it into the body and creates the identification. So we have all of this connectivity with it because our perception of reality is that who am I? And we then start to say, I'm the body and I am the mind. This is an egoic perspective. Okay, I am Nicola, I have pain in my body, I have 
back pain. So we claim it and we identify with it and we create the dis-ease within the body to break down the system, which is when we then start to feel it. But it runs from the mind from a subconscious perspective when we're in ego. Now, as we rise in, in our vibration on our ascension journey, we can then see it from this format, the I, 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 and we then observe it's getting messy. The observation, and we say, I see there is pain that my body oh, <laughs> is showing me. Okay, so we we still identify as me. And we see as me and my, the body is showing me. So the body is taking charge. And the body then decides to release with permission from mind by setting your intentions. So when you set your intentions and you say you give you give the body permission, you go like, yeah, I see it. Yeah, body. I see it. I see it. I see it. I see it. I breathe through the pain. I allow the body to do what it's got to do because the body holds breath. The body creates breath in the lung. The lung system is the uh the mechanics of breath it's the epicenter it's the focal point of breath creating from that sense to move into the embodied state into the blood into the heart into all that is is through breath through lung and then it works its way to the pain of the body and with you giving permission because you don't see yourself as mind and body only, you are in this projection of yourself. And there is where the codex is released of the density and the ignition of the inner wisdom starts to spark within you the code to remembrance. And this is what light code does. Light codes is so freaking powerful, guys. If you ignite your own codex, you can then eliminate the distortion within and remember and release the physical body withholding, release the emotional body, release the mental body, release the light body, release into the greatness of who you are, that we are created beings upon the planet and we can heal like that. We can. We can. Okay, done. Ela makiat und o korabaki tenesia, mo korabaki anto daresia. The thing that always prevents us mind. I didn't put an I in there. Mind da, and we take the I out. It becomes powerless. It just became comes m. N D. Reclaim back the eye of mind. Oh, I like that. Da la masia bakianto da sia makia. Kumolus maye tani e. Mokrabakianto da ala kiatan. Vankarabakitan e sumala. Vankarabakitan miskun mokra. Vankarabakiatan masia bakitan. Makrabakun mokush bakitan. Dala la basabakiatan asia. Mokra bakian to the ola makoshma. Tenesi bakitan esma leki. Tanta da asia tenesi bikit. Enna makiatan o korabakiatam. Dala bakadesi makosh makitan. Vankara bakitan iskia nata. Vankara bakitan iskia nukro. Vankara bakitan miskia tadasha. Allow those codes to settle within the mind's eye to ignite the insight of self, of I, of mind. 
Take the I out of mind. Breathe it into the heart, into the lung. Observe the pain within the body from an outward sense of being. Don't sense it with the body. Don't feel it from a mind perspective. Focus on the breath. Not picking up on the sensory perception yet again. Watching the body present the pain that is showing up the illusion. Letting the body heal itself. Seeing any distortion from mind and honouring it. Allowing the energy release from you through the breath codex. Breathing in the light into the lung. Setting your intentions from the mind to release and let go of any distortion that no longer serves to create this beautiful ignition so that the body heals itself. Releasing any distortion or perfection or the original template. Just observe that within. It will take time to remember to deepening into it, to release that old instruction, the energy may show itself as a click, a sound, pain, ache, All of it, just watch it, a sense of heaviness on the body. See which you are not, to allow that light to ignite. And the mind upgrades into higher mind as it calibrates into the system of frequency of light. Igniting that vibration within the deep cellular structure, allowing the body to lighten up, to offload. Mm. Sula, sula, sula. Kian tota ahla, sana, sana, sana. Kian tota okra, mogram bakieta. Dela la sieta, mogram bakieta. To heal it, we see it, we feel it, we observe it, and we allow it to move through us. Okay. Ma. Mm. I do hope this video will help you if you are experiencing any pain within the physical body or pain within the emotional body indeed. It's all the same but different. Just allow those codes to settle within the mind into remembering the journey, that the stillness of the body, the freeze of the body will keep that energy there. So observe it outwardly, inwardly, here. Allow the code of breath. And then let the body do what it came here to do by movement. Allowing the body to ignite and to heal itself.
Mm. So thank you so much for joining me. Holding that light and frequency brings me a lot of vibrational upsurge, so I'm feeling a little bit in bliss state. You may feel the same. You may feel a little bit emotional. You may be sort of the body might be showing you some things. Go like, hey, can you see? Can you see? Can you see? Can you see the distortion? Can you see it's coming up? It's coming up. It's coming up. And just let it be. Okay, let it be. The body is showing you. Mm. Check out all my links below. If you're new to light language and you want to sort of go a bit deeper into it, I have some links on Udemy. Uh, links for Udemy which is the ignition to understanding light language and then some light language transmission and how to heal the physical body mind and soul and then also my advanced um, light language course is now available if you want to link, look at that if you want to access the video data before this particular video then check that out on Patreon um, and that would be on tier two above um, and on my membership on YouTube. Okay, that. There's also Patreon also that has a free membership also if you want to join me on there. There's just got little bits of extra information and back data. Um, but I thank you so much for supporting me on my journey, um, allowing me to express myself without judgment. Um, and I do hope that the ignition of the light codes will affect you to remember, be empowered always, be empowered. And you might want to get yourself a little piece of paper or indeed a whiteboard, or whiteboard, however you want to see it to be. And just start playing about with asking yourself questions and have a little go. Okay. Okay. Take care, everyone. Don't forget to subscribe and comment in. It really helps the channel grow. Okay. Take care, everyone. Bye.